Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Ladder of Words today. Oh my god, four and six. That's horrible. 1472 with this. I swear, it's the last time I'm playing this. I swear. I swear. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know you hate it. I'm sorry, but we're doing it. We're doing it one more time. Ah, oh, isn't it? In, 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 you might be wondering, why is, why is the team called Rampar Dust? Because the way this team was described to me was that you were going to be able to just set up Rampardos and then obliterate things into a fine powder. That's what it was described to me. That's not how it's been working out in practice. But maybe, well, you know what? I'll, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give it, I'm gonna give it what, the old college try one more time. Let's see if we get a good matchup, even if it's just a decent matchup. I'll bring, I'll bring the dinosaur. I'll bring Rampardos. We'll try and do the thing. Probably not gonna happen. Bad time zoo. Bad time, the bad time zoo. I don't wanna go to a bad time zoo. Okay. It's possible here. Probably not gonna happen. Probably not. Probably not. I don't know, because if I go, <sighs> okay, if I go Smeargle Garbus, that still leaves us open to, like, a Moongus Shenan, well, no, actually, that's probably better. All right, so, really, we should be doing, there's a Landorus, we, we should really be doing the Salamence thing, but also... What's the worst that could happen? Truly, we well we could get wrecked. That that's that's one, that's for one. Um, yeah, I guess we should probably go with Rampart. No, we should, really shouldn't. But Salamence is way better. Okay, you know what? Here's here's what I'm gonna do. No matter what, no matter what, absolutely no matter what. Next game, I'm bringing Ramparos, and I don't care how hard it fails. No matter what, hold me to that. If I don't abide by that rule, the self-imposed rule that I just made up, then you get on your keyboard and go in the comments and just rip me a new one. Lander Suzumo. Okay, super glad I did not go Rampardos Forges. I don't think Lannister has anything to knock out um, Gorbis. Again, unfortunately because we don't get our white herb. But we're not going to let... Zumro protect here. Because if, if it doesn't and it tries to set up, I want to spore it. But also if the top of Coco comes in, that's really bad. I think if you're my opponent, you you turn into Tapu Koko and you belly drum, and I'm not gonna let that happen. Yeah, or not? Yeah, you turn you, you turn a switch out into Amoongus. Okay. 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 This is all right. I think if we can get an evasiveness boost on Smeargle, this is perfect. Truly. It depends what we get. That's not what we want. That's super not what we want. Because if Amoongus Rage Powder is here, that's bad. It could have Clear Smog too, which is not good. Um, Yeah, I think... You know what? If you Rage Powder... Well, no, I have to I have to follow me in case the Moose goes for a Spore. I have to. Because otherwise this whole thing gets shut down and there's no point. My opponent might... Okay, my opponent not Rage, rage Powder. So they're probably Belly Drumming and Sporing. Which is alright. Because if you do that, I don't think your plus four is not your plus four aqua jet is knocking out my salamence, and I'm pretty sure if you belly drum and you're at 75 percent health, I know because minus half your health plus the 25 of the citrus berry, pretty sure 
Oh, you just go for Tyra. Let's see. I'm pretty sure that my... Um... What's it? Who's it? Thing will just knock you out. Yeah, my Hyper Voice should just knock you out now. But you didn't play rough, so now you're at minus one. So now, I don't think you're doing anything. Defense raise. Actually fall. Okay, so Smeargle, we're just leaving it in here. We'll just leave it in here, and now we Hyper Voice. Doesn't matter what we do with Smeargle, it's a dead turn. But this, my opponent shouldn't be able to... I mean, Amoongus should go down. I think your best bet, honestly, is just protect Amoongus and play rough with um, Azumarill into the Salamence. The problem is also that I can't uh, can't use Return on Salamence because it doesn't love me. So it'll do like no damage. But this should just destroy everything. Yeah, there you go. Azumarill cannot. Belly I mean, it could Belly Drum. It shouldn't. Yeah. Is that a crit? No, it's just that strong. Well, thank goodness we intimidated it, and thank goodness we had all that stuff. <sighs> Minus one Aqua Jet. Does that take us out? I don't think so. I don't know. Plus one Earthquake. Does that take out Coco? The Hyper Voice does not. I don't think it matters here, honestly, because it's just... Yeah, Samir was still asleep. Nope. Aqua Jet, okay, but we need it to not take us out. We live on one. Oh yeah, that HP really coming in clutch. That Intimidate. Woo, buddy. And Azumarill is going to proc a Citrus Berry, I assume. Coco's gone. You're going to free switch into Naganoddle. No Citrus Berry. It must be... Assault vest? I guess. I don't know. I guess it's assault vest. I guess it's assault vest. And here's the problem. I don't know what that Landers does. That's a Scarf Landers. We're in trouble. Big trouble. If it's a Scarf Landers, though, it can't really earthquake, can it? Well, no, no, no matter what protect you I'm gonna sludge bomb you and if you're a scarf landers so be it if you're not then I think we just win some more aqua jet okay it's fine it's not scarf so yeah I think we just win and it's probably just going for an earthquake here that aqua jet kind of seems like I'm going for an earthquake but if you're locking into earthquake or if you're not really locking it if you're going for earthquake then you know whatever Rock slide. Okay, we should live that, right? I don't really know Naganoddle's bulk or anything. Now we have 84 HP EVs, so we've got like some extra. Oh, that was a crit. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright, well, remember, I said, I said in the last one that in this next video, I would bring Rampartos. In this next battle, I'll bring Rampartos to floor just no matter what. And I'm going to probably regret those words. Because this is probably going to put us like right under the 1500s. And yeah, we'd have a chance. But you know what? Whatever. I mean, you see, like a boosted Salamence is no its no friggin' joke. It sits there. It takes lives. But Naganado is just like, just, there's just so much offense happening at once. So, you know, it's good. I think it's good. I'm impressed. Salamence was bulky. Took that Aqua Jet. Again, Mega Salamence got, you know, really high defense system. I think it's like 120 defense. That, that's like the same as... That's barely... That's three points lower than Mega Venusaur's. I think that's its defensive stat. I know it's high. That's real high. 
Okay, we'll get one more. Continue the battle. 1472. Oh, no. So, okay, so it doesn't matter. Because we're not going to hit 1500 no matter what. Wait, what happened on the last one? We were 4 and 6 at the beginning of the episode. We should be... So this would actually put us... Um, at 1500 probably, or what, I don't know what happened. But here we get Tomas. Um, oh, he's got the Stantler. He's got the Stantler. And I really can't bring Rampardos. It's just not good. Oh, it's so not good. It's so bad. So bad. I said I'd bring it. I kind of don't want to. Kinda don't want to. I mean, if you go Pelipper Ludicolo, I'm I get dunked on. I bring that. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. You know what? Fine. I said I would, so I'm doing it. Bring you. Bring you. I'm not happy about it. I don't want to. I want to do the good thing. This is not the good thing. This is the very bad thing. Well, this has been fun. <laughs> yeah, it surprises me how... Just... Sometimes just like... Smeargle's setup is... I don't know. Sometimes it's really easy. Like when you play people that aren't ready for it or don't know how to play against it. They, oh, we could have... We could have done the thing on this, on this. Oh, this would have been so good. Well, actually, we would have competitive boosted the Milotic, so. All right. Here's the play. Here's the play. Milotic is going to to scald Rampardos, and I, no I, we, I need us to live it. I just want to see this happen. Hopefully, we're faster, and hopefully, we live. Did get intimidated, which is not good, so Rampardos would only be plus one after this. But I want you to at least see the interaction. To understand what I want to do. Oh, that's... Oh, oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. What are you doing with Stantler? Skill swap. Okay, well, that's not good. Oh, but that's cute, though. I see. So you can boost your Milotic. Oh, that's cute. That's really cute. I don't like that. We really do need the Sheer Force boost. But, I, I hope we can still take it out. I need Swagger. If Swagger doesn't hit, we're, we're four for them. Okay, good. Now, this should trigger Person Berry. Which should trigger Symbiosis. See, Person Berry. Right. Rampardos loses item. Symbiosis. Yes. Choice ban to Rampardos. Thank you. Okay, so now... <laughs> okay, now we're just going to rock slide everything. And we're going to helping hand. And hope that that kills my Lodic. <laughs> it probably won't. But, hey, I, we did the thing one time. We did it one time. And that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Really, truly. Unless the stand has Focus Sash, in which case, ooh, that's bad. But if it wanted to Intimidate, it either has to switch out to something else, like hopefully not Landorus. Pelipper, okay. 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 Can we hit the Thang? Okay, so this, this might looks going for a Scald into Ramparts. We could have Ally Switch, I guess. Hopefully this just takes it out. Can we hit? There's also flinch chances. Oh my god, look how much damage that does. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, that's... <laughs> that's without the sheer force. It was only plus one. Oh my god, that's great. That's so great. That makes me so happy. Okay, but now we're at neutral. Unfortunately, I'm choice band locked, which means we now have to ally switch. 
So it's like, I can't protect from a fake out. So hopefully, Ally Switch works the way I think it does. I sure hope so. I sure hope it goes before a fake out. Otherwise, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> No, it's a scald. Into, yes! Woo! Come on. I don't care. Come on. Hypnosis. Okay, so thank God that, that move sucks. If we had our Shield Force boost, this game over. That's neutral. That's fun. I like this. And now it's like, do we, do we do it again? Oh, we don't. We just uh, Moonblast through the Colo and we rock slide again. God, that's so much damage. Granted, it's, yeah. <laughs> the Rage Quit. Yes. Oh, it feels so good. This just must be what it likes to feel. I, I quit on that sense. I was trying to say, this must be what it feels like to win the Super Bowl. And instead, I went... Her, 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 her. So. Alright, okay, John. I, I get the point of this team now. Alright, it makes sense. It's pretty dirty. <laughs> Ooh, that's great. That's so great. I'm so happy with that. Well, I guys, I hope you enjoyed Ladder. If you didn't like that, I'm sorry. You, you got you got something stuck up your butt. Because that was great. Like Tony Tiger, that was great. Oh, that just makes me want Frosted Flakes. Oh, I'm hungry. Anyways, that's it for Ladder. I hope you liked it. If you did, please hit that like button down below. And if you're not already, subscribe so you don't miss any uh, future videos. Um, I'm not bringing this team back. That was a high point. We're, just, we're done. We're done with it. And I hope to see you back next time for another episode of Ladder Up where I, I will do something. I don't know. We're going to do something. It's going to be great.